Are you still using a password to open your accounts? Password is a nightmare. For users to learn strong password and keep it updated for so many accounts that we have online. Nowadays, passkeys have been introduced as the easiest, fastest, and most secure method for logging into our online accounts. And the future will be passwordless. In short, let me explain you what is passkey and why do we need it. You no longer need to access your account using passwords. Google recommend a passkey as a replacement. And you can access your account using your phone biometrics such as fingerprint, face lock, pattern or pen. According to the BBC, passkeys are expected to shape the future of our online system security. Passkey is a type of single sign-in method that works instead of both username and passwords. Previously, passwords were stored on servers, making them easy to hack. But now there is Passkey, which is used a cryptographic method for logging in, replacing password with a digital signature, or the public key and private key methods. Passkeys are highly secured against hacking methods like shoulder sniffing, social engineering, and phishing. Currently, Microsoft, Amazon, Apple, and Google have implemented passkey for their login methods. The passkey are using public key and private key. The private key is stored inside your mobile phone and the public key is stored inside the server. During the authentication, the public key and private key are matching. If it's matched, then you will be successfully logged in. Otherwise, you will not get logged into your account. And if the login happened from your own device, the system recognizes that it's you, it's not a hacker. Now let's see how to activate the passkey. For activating passkey, open your browser. On the right side, click on these dots and come to Accounts. In the left side, click on Security tab. In the below section, you can find passkeys and security keys. Click on this. Now, if you would like to register your laptop as a passkey, click on create passkey. And here you should enter your laptop and it shows that your passkey have been saved. Click on done. Now you can see I have registered to my Galaxy and as well as my laptop. If I would like to add another device for my passkey, I'm creating right here. Click on use another device. And now you should select your iPhone and click on next. Now you should open your iPhone camera and scan this QR code and click continue. The passkey have been successfully registered on my third device as well. Pretend if we have lost or we are selling our device so we should remove our device right from here. Now let's check how it will require the passkey during login. I'm just click on this and click on sign out. Let's open the browser again and click on Gmail account. Click on your account and then you can see here it will request you to enter a pin code. If I would like to use another device so I can use another device otherwise I can use my laptop pin to get login. So you can see my account have been successfully logged in with the passkey. And if you want to have more useful videos like this, please subscribe the channel and like the video. Passkey have one disadvantage and I will show you the solution. If you activated passkey inside your phone and suddenly you have lost your phone, so the recovery of your account will be much more difficult. So that's why it's highly recommended to activate it multiple passkeys, at least two or three inside your two or three smartphones. If one of them have been lost, so another will be available to get you login into your account. Engineer says that the passkey will be the better and secure method for logging into your account in the future. And what do you think? Please share your thoughts in the comments. And thank you Allah Fez.